beautiful morning at the beach. Good morning. Hi, I'm Lavi. And I'm Ollie. And this is our hero, Bumblebee. Together, we are attempting a Guinness World Record to become the youngest pair to circumnavigate the globe by, by motorcycle. motorcycle. Join us for season three here in South America. Good morning world, welcome back to the channel. It's day number 291 on our circumnavigation around the globe by motorcycle. Good morning Bumblebee. <laughs> Good morning Bumblebee. We're here camping in front of the beach next to this little village called Pichicoy just off of the Ruta 5 highway in Chile. Whee! Yesterday we finally arrived here on the Pacific coast of South America. Yesterday was our first time seeing the Pacific Ocean so we decided why not camp just right in front of it. Yes we had a really peaceful night and the night sky was just amazing here. And now that we've hit the west coast it's time to make our way north. So let me show you guys where we're heading today. So here's Santiago and we are here on the coast. Over the next three days we're trying to make it onto the next page to Antofagasta but today we are going to be heading up along the coast here past La Serena and trying to make it somewhere between La Serena and Valinar. Our aim is to get as far north as we can today so we don't know exactly where we're gonna end up or where we're gonna camp tonight but it's already 7.15 and we have to pack up everything so better hit the road let's go. It's a beautiful morning at the beach. Sandy start. Oh yeah look at this. <laughs> ah, traction by... Antlers, I guess. <laughs> oh, I liked it, traction by Dunlop. Oh, I miss it too. <sighs> I can't fault it at the moment. I mean, seems to be doing fine with this uh, terrain. Yeah, absolutely. Feels nice and smooth, eh? Yeah, good old Antlers Capra X. <laughs> Always a little bit tricky in the morning. Yeah, if you want to get to the nice wild camps, you got to go through a little bit of difficult roads. Okay, a little bit more. Yeah. And you know, I have been watching those Dakar rally videos, so... <laughs> <laughs> Skill level reached. <laughs> All right. All right. But here we go. Coming back onto the Ruta 5 highway. From now on, it's easy. 725 miles to Antofagasta. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. And I was actually really scared that this part will be really, really hot. But we checked the temperature this morning and it's just about 25 degrees during the day. So it's really, really nice riding temperature. And I'm so happy about that. In Santiago, it was like 35 degrees. Yes. So it's nearly 10 degrees colder here on the coast and right now it's only 16 degrees so so it really should be a quite nice ride today <laughs> We just stopped here at a rest area at the service station and it's really cool because here in Chile on some rest areas they have um, tubs here where you can fill up water and it's drinkable water so I thought I use the opportunity and fill up all our water bottles because we are using the water for cooking, brushing the teeth, drinking of course so we're having one and a half liter here and then we have these camel bags here which are two liters so we have about five to six liters water with us and this will just last us for the day actually so we are filled up for the day perfect yummy 1.5 kilos of granola finished <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of granola that was the biggest bag ever we just saw a big sign saying queso cheese it looks and like that uh, they are open yeah it does look like they're open awesome queso hola buenas oh queso hola 
<risa> ah, ¿Cuánto cuesta una...? una... Esto 8000 y esto 10.000 Ah, oh, ok. ¿Es diferente que eso? I think it might be like a mature and a fresh. Cool. Muchas gracias. Is that? It's a, a cabra. I think it's quite nice. Yeah. Perfect. Hello. 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 We got ourselves a nice circle of cheese. A whole block. And so that was 8,000. 8,000. So eight pounds. Cool. When we stopped, we weren't exactly expecting goat's cheese, but you know, we'll roll with it. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> I mean, it's like a little bit of variation, hey? There we go. Adios. <laughs> He's just chilling. Look at this guy. We have some more of these cactus hedges that we saw yesterday coming up here. And some of them flowering! No way! Yes! Is that a flower? In between you can see some of them having like red flowers I think. Oh beautiful! Or something red! I don't know if these are flowers or not, I don't know! <laughs> yeah, there's some beautiful cactus covered hills around us. Very nice! Yeah, and the ride so far is pretty chilled. Yeah, we've managed to do 122 miles already this morning and it's not even midday, so we're doing incredibly well. Yes, and the temperature is just 23 degrees, so it's just the perfect riding day, really. Ah oh, yeah, the petrol station is coming up as well. Maybe it's time for a little lunch break as well for us, hey? Some bread and cheese? <laughs> test out this new goat's cheese. <laughs> this is one of the only fuel stations for like another 100 miles or so, so it's always good as we're getting a bit more remote to just fill up whenever we can. Yeah. So did you tie up your hair then? Oh my god. Oh my god. The real purpose of their hair is revealed. We bought some butter in Santiago and the butter is just everywhere, like it's so melted. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this mess! So we have to use it up now because it just gets hotter and hotter. And then we have some nice avocado on top and of course our new cheese. So it will be a, a really nice feast. Whoa, look at this! I really didn't expect it but it's super hot. It's like parmesan cheese. Yeah, it's mature, hey? Wow! Have you ever had mature goat's cheese before? No! No, me neither. Bon appetit! <laughs> Just coming up to La Serena. This is one of the bigger towns or cities in this area. Yeah, it was actually really unexpected. We went just like over the hill and then there was this massive town here <laughs> <laughs> popping up. Oh, and they got some high-rise condos here. Look at this! Directly on the ocean. A lane just for bumblebee. <laughs> I mean, it's a really big town here, actually. miles down for today so we're doing really well and I saw a sign over here at the petrol station for some papaya juice Hugo de papayas helados cold cold papaya juice dos por favor two 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 thousand two thousand yes, yes. perfect yes. and what do you have here is this also papaya and where where do they grow the papaya because here is desert. It's fruit in all the Serena city. Yeah, crazy, no? Yeah? Beautiful. Where are you from? Uh, England. 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 I learned English in La Serena. You I learned English. Ten years ago, Ten years I, ago. Went, I went to Germany. No way. Especially Deutsch? No, in Australia. No. I want to see Angla. We are from Yes. Nice Thank to you. meet you. Thank you. Nice Thank you. you. Yes, yes. Papaya juice. <laughs> Look how healthy we are! 
I'm not sure. It tastes like they add sugar to this. It tastes really nice. It's beautiful, but I think it might be some papaya and then sugar and water. I'm not sure. <laughs> Very good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Amazing. Gracias. Ciao. <laughs> yeah, that was a really lovely papaya juice. <laughs> I like them. <laughs> yeah, and now we are rested. We're ready for the final leg of the day. So we want to get somewhere around another 100 miles for today and that'll put us up to 300 for the day and well within our two-day goal of reaching Antofagasta. Yes, let's go! Let's do it! Just coming up to our camping spot for the night. We have hit 294 miles so far today. Woo! <laughs> it is time to come off the route of five. Oh yes. We found the spot on I Overlander and it says that it's quite hidden and people had a good night. So let's see if that is true. Oh yes. <laughs> well it's certainly <laughs> hidden from tarmac that's for sure <laughs> oh no it just said actually just somewhere along this road here actually okay so i would say we would just ride a little bit down and see i mean the road doesn't look that bad actually no no it looks fine and with our new tires ho 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 traction by anlas <laughs> I think actually up and over this hill okay and then we'll be like uh -huh. defo hidden from okay. the road yeah i mean i don't know where this road goes to <laughs> i'm not sure i can see nothing <laughs> oh okay i tell you what just here up before this hill this will be good somewhere here let's have a look what have we got okay wait a second yeah maybe some of the sandy bits here wow look at this place <laughs> it's proper desert out here okay if you move that rock just down there um, the big one and then i'm just going to ride through the, those two little bushes Yeah, just about all right. This is definitely a dry riverbed though. Okay. Do you think it's likely that it could have like a like a rain coming down? No, it is uh we're in the desert, I guess, hey. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Let's set up camp then. Good evening, guys. We made it. Happy and alive. Yes. <laughs> Yes, we've set up our camp and we're now hiding under the shade of Chris's parasol. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> Let me show you guys around. 
So we've got the tent set up in front of us here and around us is just all these bushes. We're in this dry riverbed here, so it's nice and soft and sandy. And look at it out here. It's quiet, it's peaceful, it's beautiful. And we just saw on the sign a little while back that we've officially entered the Atacama Desert region. Yes, yeah, so it's super exciting that we actually camp the first night here in the Atacama Desert. Yes, how <laughs> awesome is that? Wow, I think we're gonna have a really, really nice night here. I think so too. But that's it from us today. At the end, we did 295 miles, which is about 470 kilometers. And we hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and family, comment below, and we will see you next time.